Hi guys, welcome back to Red Dog Gaming, where today we are continuing our Let's Play of Sparta in Rome Total Realism Imperium Surrectum. Yes, very excited to be back. I'm playing just straight after the first episode, so any comments you've put there I will be looking at, and I will be looking at the comments on this video. As I said, guys, this video will be up a few hours after that first one, so you can binge it. So... Please don't worry about which uh, which video you put your comments on because it won't matter. I'll still be checking them all. So, last time, we expanded our region by three, four times. We got three new regions. We only have the one Sparta region. So, we are ready to really get going and expand. And it looks like the rebels on Kyrene only have um, one little army uh so we'll go after them and then we'll probably have a look at roads to see whether we can go after roads as well and um, hopefully they're not allied with the antigonids but oh well right our diplomat you went there let's go see whether we can find the romans maybe who are you kingdom of eperos oh were we not allied before you have a lot of allies and your uh, your enemies with the antigonids so no let's not deal with you let's see hello are you who are you? You're a rebel, but the Romans might have you soon. Let's go find some barbarians then maybe to trade with, or maybe the Kingdom of Thrace. But I think we're at the end of a turn, guys, so we'll end the turn here. Yeah, path blocks, I don't care. Let's end the turn. I hope you enjoyed the last episode anyway. I certainly did. It was good fun. And Sparta is a very fun nation to play, especially in this area of the world. <laughs> You can see everything is sort of starting to happen now. I hope the Antigonids get rid of that rebel army, really. That is my big hope currently. So is that a fort down there that they've built next to Thermon? Why would you build a fort, boys? Like, why? Thermon fort. There's also a fort here. Why would you build a fort? <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> see how many they've got of Pella. Not that many. You can see there's quite a bit of unit diversity, of course, in this mod as well, guys. Like, really diverse uh, units, which is awesome. Now, how are we? We were on 2,500 last turn, and now because we've retrained all these boys, we're back down to, like, nothing. <laughs> but that's not a problem. I'm slightly worried. I am slightly worried about these guys attacking one of my cities while I'm away. Uh, oh, we got a new general coming of age. Arotos, Aratos of Sparta. Hmm. He can't move, though. That's annoying. So you can actually go to Argos. Go to Argos. And these guys can come and join us on the ships. So let's get the army organized. Your Aratos. You look pretty good, honestly. Good defender. Superior builder. Homely, unfortunately. But calm. Respects his father. So incre increasing his father's traits. Increases the likelihood of the son having his father's traits. Takes after his father. He's a Spartiates, um, which is great. Spartan at Gogi. Agiad dynasty again, and he's sharp. Let's actually have a look at our family tree. We uh, we haven't had a look at it yet. So we have Arias, we have Acro Acrotatus, and Aratos. We have one more though. Oh, we have two. So we have the. Uh, Agiads, and we have these guys as well. You you Eudemidas. You Eudemidas. So what are you? Like, what's your... You're the uh, Yuri Pontid dynasty. You're not the Agiad. So, okay, that's cool. But Areas is a bit of a beast. So let's get him going. Let's go with you guys first. Do we say we're going to bring you as well? You get in there. Then we'll go with the rest of you. And let's... Oh, what is this? Why is there a massive rebel fleet just right outside our gates? Well, I guess we wait. We'll get to the port and we'll wait there. So, path block, diplomat. Yeah, Spartan Agogi. I don't know how you say that. Agogi? I don't know. <laughs> how do you say it? You've moved. Where's our spy then? Where's he gone? Our spies died. How's he died? I could have... Sw oh, he died getting in here then, didn't he? 
Let's put the uh, this up. While we are here, then, we might as well recruit someone else. We'll go for another Peroikoi, I think, because they're very good. 456 to train, uh, upkeep, though, which is crazy, crazy money. Greek Peltas, Phalangites, and Rhodian Slingers. Oh, well, let's uh, end the turn. Get on to the next turn as quick as possible. Just going to have a sip of my drink. How is he attacking us? We're in port. Yeah, like... We died. Like, our ships died, bro. Because of you, Antigonids. We were in port. But apparently we died as well. Well... We'll have to get this Byrene. We'll have to spend all our money on it, unfortunately. We are making a decent amount of money now. I am quite pleased with the amount of money we're making. So, Thessalonica. Uh, they've got a, n a number of troops everywhere, really, haven't they? Let's come down this way. The Getai. We should probably talk to them because they're close by. I wonder whether they've got any, you know, ports so we can trade. Made plus seven. Aegeon got the... Uh, the upgrade, we can go straight to the level 1 annexation, which allows us to train things here, I think. That's probably what we want to do next, but we're not going to be able to afford it. So the next thing we should do is probably upgrade our farms everywhere. Ah, no, actually. We should probably get the Governor's Villa. We're going to be just under getting the Governor's Villa. So is there anywhere we can put the uh, tax rate up? No. Uh, let's see if getting you in here gives more money. Nope, it gives no extra money at all. That's sad. It's very sad. You should join this army as well. Right, let's uh, end the turn again, guys. We will chew through turns in this mod, guys, because it's a lot more strategic, strategic, a lot more tactical, a lot. You have to do a lot more. Oh, hello. Is that Athens? Well, that's a good excuse to attack Athens, isn't it? A really good excuse. Looks like the Antigonids might be trying to. Tango with that rebel army, which is great. I mean, we can even get the ships across to Athens. Um, I don't like that rebel army being right there, though. <laughs> it's really not ideal. Oh, stop coming back, bro. Keep coming back for more. What type of ship is it? Pirate ships, which will probably be better than my ships, right? 15, 18, 32. And then mine are 15, 12, 26. Yeah, it's a lot better. Oh, well. Oh, well. That's uh, reduced our income hugely as well because of trade. I think if we wait here one turn, we will be able to move unless they attack us. If they attack us, though, I'm hoping the Antigonids will come in. We'll see. Agent found Argos in Athens. Um, Athenian... Guy. That's why he thought he could attack, because he saw Argos was undefended and attacked. Aetolians and Idrissians are now allies. Okay, no problems. Let's go talk to Thrace, the Idrissian kingdom. You're just allied with one person. Let's go for an alliance map information. No, you want just trade rights, probably, is what you're after. A most generous proposal. Yep. How about an alliance? No, still demanding. Okay, map for map, then. Probably won't accept. No. We must they don't like trading map information. Um, right, let's go talk to... I oh, should have probably looked around for the Getai diplomat again. Oh, well. Uh, we'll talk to them. We'll leave you here. I just don't want to have to waste money and resources fighting these rebels. And I'm hoping this Antigonid army attacks it. So, okay. Right, let's end the turn. Nope, they didn't attack it. Or maybe they did. Oh, they did and pushed it backwards. So if we get out their way, we should be good. Well, Athens, you've left an army undefended out there, my friend. It's good for us. Hello, end of turn. Fantastic. Can you move, my friend? Ah, oh, so hard to get you to move. Okay, there we are. Your, I mean, what army is that? Oh, it's a lot of piss pissy lie. Wish we could get some 
some cav here. Mercenary hoplites. Tarantine cavalry. 2,400. That's another thing. Mercenaries are so expensive. I think we beat that relatively easily. And then we just siege him down. It's 10 turns to siege him down though. Ooh. Kingdom of Kyrene and the Ptolemaic Empire are now at war. Oh god. Boeotians and Adresians. Is that Boeotians and Adresians are allies? Okay. That's fine. Hello, Getai. Alliance? No, still demanding. How about trade rights? A most generous proposal. Map for map, my bro. Balanced. A most generous yes. Proposal. We now know that the Getai have two settlements out here. Let's uh, go up towards Rome. That's definitely something we want to do. Right then, uh, what do we do? Do we try and attack that and then try and take both of these armies in one battle? I don't think we do. I think that's a bit too risky. Maybe the groups at Chalcis will come and help us. Looks like we are highly favoured here. The missile cavalry is going to be annoying, but we'll use our archers to deal with them. Well, I'll see you... Uh, yeah, I can't... This is going to be good. And then we'll take Athens, which shall finally be ours. After many years of being in filthy Athenian hands, Athens shall once again be ours. Ah, oh, this is fun, guys. This is really fun. I'm enjoying it. Oh, I can't wait to smash some Athenian skulls into the curb. Destroy them. Destroy them all. We will listen to these little mini speeches because they're not long, are they? But we listen a little bit. Victory is near at hand. If all do their duty, it will be our victory. Bend your backs to your tasks and all will be well. Is that it? Oh, well. Okay. No problem. You guys, you guys have good enough range to be behind. You guys get there. Then big hoplite line. We need to charge before the missile men come in. In fact, we might even stick our missile men in front. Oh my god, what is that? They're running away. Why would you run away, you fools? Forgot to get this guy in. Let's, uh... So uh, let's probably like get reasonably close. Where are you going, bro? Why? Fuck me! Stop being so dumb! Are you just withdrawing? Like you can't withdraw, bro. Like you literally can't withdraw. Like why was the point of that? That just did nothing for you. Good lord! Sometimes the AI is infuriating, man. Got a lot of cav. That's the problem here. Ah, he's sending his Greek cavalry in. I don't like that. Get back, get back. Get back, boys. Get back. Get back, you bastard. I'll break your legs. Deciding to charge is not the best idea. You've already seen this, boys. They're just running. You can keep running. It's not going to make a difference. You're still going to die. At the hands of the Spartans. Yeah, skip forward. Let's see. They should. They will probably be able to fire their javis now. So let's go. And let's protect the flank over here. Get you guys. They're running. Fools. Only fools run. Okay, here comes the general. Get into the general. Get you, get the Pisoli. He's going mad, this general. What is he doing? Get into the general there, then. All that matters is we take these guys out. Oh, my God. They take so much damage from the uh, damn... You guys get forward. Just to shoot at those archers. What are these flags? These are not the same flags. I don't get it. Where's our guy? Our general. We need archers. Where are you? Need you to come and fire at the missile cavalry. 
Shoot, it, kill him. Go, boys. Apart from you, you get to deal with them. We need to kill them all as well. That's the thing. All 80. We need to kill 80. Oh, God. Go, go, go. This is going to be tough. Where's... Ah! They came into these guys. Oh, well. You guys should be firing on them if you can. Are you fighting? Who are you fighting? Get in there. Get in! Kill the pissy, pissy loys. Surround them. Get them. Go after the general. Come on. Come on, guys. Kill them all. That's who you should be firing at. Yeah, kill him. He needs to die. He shouldn't have anywhere to run, really, because we're right on this side of the map. God, how tough are these Cav, bro? They seem very tough. You guys all get into them. Right, you always come over here. Get through them while they're uh, charging through you. Would be ideal. Well, if anything... You fire at him. You fire your jabbies at him as well. Go, go, go. Into those boys. Kill him. Come on. How are the, the amount of javelins going into him? How is he not dead? Fire. Fire. Stupid archers as well. How the hell is he not dead? Right, speed it up. What a joker! Come on, bro. You're not. You're just. You're never gonna escape this. Kill them all. Ah. Fucking piss, pissy loys. The pissy loys again. These poor healer archers have, been, have taken a battering this uh, this one. Kill the Greek archers. Continue. Kill them all. Pursue them. Drive them from the battlefield. Ah, oh, poor, poor Greek archers taking an absolute battering. Nice, the pissy lawyer going. Go on, the pissy loy. Let's go, boys. Yeah, nice. Oh, we still lost 250. Especially these guys took a battering. I think they were charged into, though. That cavalry is just so strong. We need to get our own. We need to get our own as soon as possible. Like It's, it's obscenely, obscenely strong. A lot stronger than even in base game where it's obscenely strong. See, those guys were just missile cav. And they shredded a hoplite unit. So I think he's dead. Unless he's on this boat. Doesn't look like he routed. He must must have come into here then. He only, yeah, he only has one now. Or, did, or is that him? I don't know. I think we uh, attack though. Take that, and then a few... I'd like ladders would be ideal, but I guess we'll have to take siege towers. Right, how are we looking over here? Could do with more archers. We can't even train archers, though. I think we've got the money to train the cavalry units, but we need to focus on our economy early game, definitely. So let's keep on going with that. Oh, we were going to upgrade this, weren't we? I think we save money for one more turn. So let's do that. How are you doing, my friend? Good. Our spy has died. Is there anywhere else we can train a spy? No, just diplomats. That's annoying. Stupid Athenians. You fools. 
I'd love them to sally out right now. I don't think it's going to happen. No, it's not. See, fighting through the city is going to be tough. Like, it's it's not going to be fun, is it? Oh, well. Going to have to try, I think. I think it's the best thing to do is to try. So, we've got 3,500 now, which is good. Let's go with, yeah, the Governor's Villa over here. And is the, yeah, we should probably start going with some of these certain places. If not, no, land clearance ideally, actually. Let's go for communal farming over here. Well, let's check it versus Sparta. That's about 210. Um, get rid of that. How much is it here? Oh, wow. That's a lot of money. We'll get that in Sparta then. Yeah. <laughs> I am worried about this army. It's a lot of... Uh, a lot of infantry, honestly. I think we I think we wait a few turns at least to bring it down. And just build up our thing. Spartan Agogi training. So has he finished it? This character, he is now eligible for and can vote uh, and can vote, but his training will continue until the age of thirty. Two general hit points, which is decent. Let's see, he's, he's in friendly territory. We should read some of these at some point. Yeah, this guy is a cryptire. Uh, was a traditional tradition involving young Spartans regime. Its goal and nature is still a matter of discussion. Completed their tra training with such success that they were marked out as potential future leaders. Cool. Yes. That's good. He's a bit hasty, though. He's a very good character, actually. He's pretty decent. He can now move, but we're not going to move him because um, he's in one of the cities ruling it, which is fine. So, let's see. Yeah, I think that's everything we want to do this turn. Unless... Ah, oh, we need to move you, don't we? That's the Getai. Who are you? You're just a rebel. Let's go talk to the Romans. Find an unholy alliance. If possible. Let's end the turn. I think the Antigonids... We must go our separate way. Oh, come on, Antigonids. That means they're going to declare war on oh, us. Thanks. Alliance? A most generous proposal. Well, <laughs> that saves them from attacking us for 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 a turn anyway. <laughs> so it looks like we need to de need to uh, defend ourselves. Oh, they did sally out the boys. Wow, they. That's more troops than they had before, right? It's going to be a tough battle, but knowing the AI and siege and siege sally outs, they might just send them out one by one. Hmm. We'll go for it. We'll go for it. We've got to try and win this. This is huge. This is really big. It does look like their army is considerably better than ours. Oh, crash. Oh, God. Crash straight to desktop, guys. Well, I'll see you in a sec. So, here we are again, guys. I've tried it one other time, and it did crash again. So, there must be... There's either an issue with one of the units, probably, or one of the... All the battle maps. So, I'm going to retreat and see what happens. They might come after us. Nope, they didn't. Athens... Oh, look at that army they've got in Athens now. So they've obviously just spawned a huge garrison somehow. I think that's from that might be from us attacking it. Is that bigger than what we were facing? Yeah. Bigger than what we were facing before. I think. We send our ships around. How far can they go? Can they? They can still get to Crete. So I think we go for that. And we leave the Antigonids to deal with them. Obviously, I did want Athens. It would have been nice. But we did a decent enough job destroying some of their troops anyway. Oh, hello, Rhodes. Yes, they don't have anything. Cretan Hoplites. Athens and the Antigonids. Uh, Antigonids are a bit scary. I'm, I'm, I'm still worried about them. 
let's get back to port while we can. And let's do this battle. Oh, they've, they're damaged as well. So it looks like Rhodes did fight them. Mercenary Greek Peltas. One sec. Can we get any cavalry? Oh. Cavalry! We need cavalry. So I'm going to get a cavalry stables here as soon as we can. If not at Aegeon, can we get one? No. Hmm. Doesn't look like we can get them anywhere. Do we have a military dictatorship here? No, we don't. So we don't need it anywhere else. Uh, city barracks. We could get the city barracks, but it's two more turns on that on that left. How are we building? We're building nearly everyone. Aegeon we aren't, so let's go for the communal farming. Should we get some more troops? I'm not quite sure. I think we'll, I think we'll leave it for now. But let's uh, let's get on with this battle. So he's just got that one guy there. He's got his cavalry. He's got the Podromai. And he's got the Cretan archers and the Greek Peltas. The problem is those Cretan archers are going to just run away like they did in the last one. But to be honest, as long as they're running and not firing, that's okay with me. Should be a relatively okay battle. We just need to make sure that we get rid of all the troops um, so that we can take the city. Otherwise, Rhodes might sweep in and take it before we get a chance, which would be... Highly annoying. <laughs> highly, highly annoying. But no. In fact, this you know this might turn out for the better anyway. Honestly. Yeah, definitely it might do. It might, fingers crossed, <laughs> than taking Athens. But those crashes, pretty annoying. But oh well. You know, when you're playing such a huge mod, you've got to expect it. I mean, look at my uh, Empire 2 Total War campaign. That just broke in the end, unfortunately. But this shouldn't because it's a workshop one, but let's see. Let's listen. This battle is inevitable, but victory hangs in the balance. Act like Sans of Achilles, and victory will be within our grasp. Way! Come on, the boys. You there. I don't know where he'll go and hide, so you there, and then we'll get our, get them in a bit of a thicker line this time. As I say, we... oh, they're going straight for us. Let's get there. I hate the trees, man, and I hate that you can't get rid of them. You guys get there. I mean, if anything, you want to be up here, but get the uh, general over this side. Where is their second army? It's coming. Let's go forward. General, let's get you there. Oh, good charge. You should get a decent charge off on them. They should be coming now. Here comes the Greek cavalry. We've got to watch out for that. They're going to go straight through there, aren't they? If they do, we'll surround them. Let's go. Yeah, they. Th we got a load of jabbies off into them, which is good. Why can they just... Apparently, they can just run through my troops, bro. Go. Get them. You guys go. General, let's go. Oh, he, they ruin their general every time. He might run away with these guys, these uh, hoplites that are coming. That's the one thing that worries me slightly. Come on, how are you still dying so much, bro? Is it to the Cretans? Get after him. Fine with me, this. Oh, go on, you nearly caught them. Yes, into them. Let's go, you guys go. Yes, we killed the general. Nice. Let's go. Go, go, go. Oh, those jabby shots are incredibly annoying, but what can we do right now? Why are the archers just running through us? 
How can they do that? They just killed like 25 men through just running through us, not even attacking us. That's bollocks, bro. Yeah. Oh, look at them all dying. Nice. They should not be able to do that. Just run through our men like that. Right, how's it going over here? Right, you boys need to get ready to face this guy, wherever he is. And I want to send one of you guys up this way to try and deal with them. Kill these mercenary Greek Peltasts. Kill them. They have been incredibly annoying. Same with you guys. You need to get up here to shoot these guys. And you two Peltasts. Oh, if anything, I should send you up as well. And we'll use you over here. How many have we killed? 40%. We need to get it to 85. Like we spoke about before. Fire your jabbies, boys. Oh, God, I hate that noise. It's horrible. You guys get there, and then you boys will surround them. Fire those, and I'll get in. See, look, watch this push, right? It's going to kill loads of our troops. Get around. Oh, they've brought the cab back. As if they've done that. Get this cab. I don't think we'll make it to 85, you know. But we will be able to do a siege battle straight away. You guys get in. You guys get in. You guys fire. Nearly 50 now, though. Oh, they've come back to life. That's actually great for us. Who are these boys? We should actually get, make it. Took a few hits. I really don't want my faction leader to die, though. That is one thing. That 100% can't happen. You guys get out. Get in. I just need to kill them like all. I need it for my sanity, okay? God, the archers got shredded there, didn't they? These guys are fully surrounded now. Yeah, keep firing away. They're doing quite well, actually, The uh, these guys. So I think we'll go back for a bit of a retraining once we've done with this. We'll send a few troops back for retraining anyway. Come on, boys. Cretan archers, you should be shredding them. Guys, get over there to try and surround them a little bit more. You can also move the general away because he should be on the left-hand side. Now we'll get in. Rally. Kill them. Kill them. Where's our... Oh, you're chasing these guys down here. Have you killed them all yet? Like, who are you chasing? Yeah, they're all dead now. Oh, someone's routing. It's these guys. Probably get a bit closer. Probably get, like, there. God, that's really tough. Well, you're not going to get that anymore, are you? Let's get you back. You're all knackered, but you might be needed. I, I hope you're not needed. You shouldn't be needed. We have plenty enough troops to deal with these guys. All right, speed it up. I'm not too wor worried about these guys getting damaged. They can get retrained very easily. Nope, kill them. Kill them. Kill them all. Come on, boys. Get them. Get them all. How many have we killed? I mean, it will say 1% because the others have routed. So I don't know until we end the battle whether we've got enough to get in the city or not. Get them. How can you not get these two guys? Come on. You're running alongside them. I don't think they can get the animation off. 
because I'm running about the same speed. <laughs> Come on, boys. You can do it. Yes, you did it. Oh, they actually did really well. Those those troops were reasonably strong again. Everyone did okay. We really, we're not getting a lot of experience from these battles, though, which is a bit, bit annoying. But what can you do? What can you do? That's an awesome picture. I love some of the artwork in this. It is really cool. Really cool. Very cool indeed, my friends. Very cool indeed. Ah, oh, yes. Another city taken then, hopefully. If it's not, that would be... Annoying. <laughs> but it, uh, hopefully it is another city. I, I think it is. Um, and I'm, I'll probably scout out roads with my ships before landing the troops there. I, I think the Antigonids, once they've taken Athens, will be ready to go to war with us as well, which is unfortunate, but... Oh, well. We've got to find alternative routes of expansion, which is what we're doing now. Because <laughs> the Antigonids, yeah, we need to be strong to beat them. We need a good full stack to start fighting their armies. If not two, but it's going to be so much money to get two full stacks. So, whew, I don't know. We probably won't get to that point. We'll probably be on one full stack and we're going to have to be as efficient as possible. That means taking defensive battles where we can, like cities, like river crossings. Especially with our hoplites. They should be very good on a river crossing. But cavalry is a big thing right now. We need... We just need one unit of cavalry in this army just to make sure that we pursue all the enemy and get rid of them. And to just add that impact. Everyone else has um, has cavalry generals. We don't. So that's a big problem for us right now. Come on. Come on, Matt. You can get there. You can do it. You can do it, Matt. There we are. I was going to say. Hope it's not crashing again. Um, but yes, we did take it. So that's good. Uh, let's enslave. It's a large town as well, which is awesome. And it has stone walls. And it's got a uh, conquered land occupation. That's not for us. That's for us. Oh, we could really do with a port here. Hmm. I think we go for the conquered land occupation here. Are we building everywhere else? Yes, we are. Fantastic. Let's see whether Rhodes declares war on us. We'll uh, scout with our ships next turn. See how many troops they've got on Rhodes. I'm hoping uh, not many. <laughs> not like Athens. We've got a load of troops. Let's go talk to the Romans as well. What have the Romans ever done for us? Apart from the roads, and the aqueducts, and the schools. Yeah. <laughs> Apart from all that, what have the Romans ever done for us? So this, these, Patavium's still in rebel hands, but the Romans should be down here. Syracuse and Republic of Carthage are at war, and Getai and Tigonids are allies now. Interesting. Argos got that upgrade. Awesome. We could go for the neck we could go for a long oh, we could go for a port here. I honestly think a port there would be hugely beneficial to our economy. Because like look, it, it doesn't really show. It says 247 and 28. But let's see. So 180 so say it's about you know 420 what the trade's gonna become. What it says the trade's gonna become, but we'll check it when it actually gets done because it Adds another trade fleet, which I don't think it adds into this, just as part of the base game. Not not part of the mod, just as part of the base game. It doesn't like to do that for some reason. I think we'll go for occupied land. Um, we're still building there. We're still building here. So let's go scout. Oh, come on, bro. What does he have? Pirate ships as well. You know how to blockade a man, don't you? All right, let's end the turn then. Those pirates, man. Pirates. So, oh, look at that uh, Athenian army. What 
was that? Uh, the pirates. Oh, uh, the pirates have moved. That's good. Has Rhodes moved though? That's the thing. Has Rhodes gone? I think they. they I think they went last turn, didn't they? They no. They still stand here. They haven't got much of an army. Well, what's happened? Was that general died? He was assassinated. That was our faction leader, bro. Wasn't that our faction leader? Assassinated. Seleucids and Pergamon are at war. And the Seleucids and the Ptolemaics. Oh my god. That's a lot of war. I can't believe you killed him. You fools. Be nice to... We need someone in Sparta at all times, really. Uh, well, let's get the... Uh, get the cavalry stables now. And Gortina. Let's go for the port. And now the uh, rebels have gone. Let's have a look at Rhodes. I mean, they don't look like they've got much, do they? Problem is their ships... So, we'll come back to safety, and then I think next turn we'll probably go for it. Oh, we could do with getting these guys back I, and retraining them. I think we'll go and retrain the army first. It's, I know it's slow, but it's it's 100% worth it. We've got a lot of things building next turn, so it's good, wise to save the money right now. So, let's do that. Ah, I forgot about you. Hello, Rome. Aretium. Nice to see you. I wonder whether we can get a trade agreement, my friends. Um, you gonna declare war? Yeah, looks like it. I mean, it's a siege battle, so I think we'll be okay. But they do have a relatively decent amount of troops there, it looks like. Relatively decent. Hmm. Well, Rhodes, you brought this on yourself, okay? You brought whatever hell... Will be reaped upon you, upon yourself. Trade rights. A most generous proposal. Alliance and map information. We see no benefit to us. Um. Okay. Would you consider? No, that definitely Until wouldn't. Just for time. map information, I would not consider that. But at least we got trade rights. So even if we lose trade rights with other people, we should be getting. Oh, hello, Massalia. We'll, we'll definitely trade with you. You're Greeks. I can't believe we got one of our guys got assassinated. He was a young guy as well, wasn't he? So you should definitely go in there, and you should go in there. The problem is, that assassin is still around. He might assassinate someone else. <laughs> oh, good lord. Well, Rhodes, you don't look like you have the strongest of garrisons ready to attack us. Argos got a port, which is great. Should probably go for the mines here because it's a thousand per turn for the mines. Let's go for the trader. It only gives you 68. It's it's probably still worth it. It'll pay for itself in like 15 turns. That's not too bad. And then Aegean. How about this? How much does that give? See that's see that's not good. Increase in trade. I don't think that is accounted for, though. I, th I think it will be more than that. Did that? So that port was that the one we were looking at? Yeah, it was actually about four hundred thirty-one, five hundred for mining. It says a thousand here. Hmm. I'm not sure. So Aegean, we don't want to build that, do we? How much does this do? Public order. I think we go for the second level of military garrison. Or is it the first level? And so we can uh, train some troops. And I think we train another one of these to send across next turn if they haven't taken it already. I think we'll be okay, you know. I know we've not got a lot of infantry left. But we have a lot of javelins to throw. So they have eight units, and they're probably quite well off. 
I really don't want to lose Arias. He is brilliant. This guy is going to become our new general as well. A crotato. A potatoes! A crotatoes! A crotatoes! A crotatoes! Boil and mash them, stick him in a stew. What a beast. As if he's called potatoes. What a name. So I'm surprised that the, the uh, Antigonids have not gone after these guys yet. And they haven't cleaned up Athens yet. Hmm. Do we send across someone else? I don't know. I mean, I might even I might send this guy across. And see whether we can get any of these next turn. Maybe some Cretan archers. Let's end the turn. Oh, we're going down again. Whoops. Sorry, guys. It's a bit jarring, isn't it? Our economy is in a decent situation now, but a large... Oh, I forgot. See, why, why can we not escape that? I forgot to put them back. Why did I not put them back? That's another thousand wasted. Oh, God. Annoyance. 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 Oh, so they have put both their armies together. It looks like it. Do we take the Greek Peltas as well? I think we need to take everything we can just to make sure we win this battle. And we don't attack him. It's still got six turns to go. I think he will attack when he's ready. Now, we don't have a ship anymore. We've got no troops there. So, we'll stick you in there. Even though... We should probably use these guys to uh, man garrisons because they're trash. Everywhere else building. Nice. Still besieging. Yeah, they put their armies together. Getai and the Seleucids. That's a weird alliance, but okay. I'll accept it. Yeah. Masalia, where did you go, my friend? Oh, here. Yes. You have... A most generous proportion. Alliance? Map information? Maybe not alliance. Map information, map information, A my boy. Generous nice. Now we can actually see. They still, looks like they still only just have Massalia. Oh, well. Looks like the Romans are coming to uh, talk with them. Let's go down, see if we can find the Iberians. Should have probably gone for Anatolia, but... Oh, there is a land, land uh, thing there. I didn't realize that. Oh, well, we'll still go after the... There's no point going there now. We're too far away. <laughs> oh, this Athenian army scares me slightly. All right, let's end the turn. See what Rhodes wants to do. Come on, Rhodes. All Rhodes. Lead to Rhodes. For us. No, not attack this turn. It will get to the point where we will have to attack them. But it's not that point yet. A couple more turns. And I'm hoping they will they will siege us down. They will go for the siege. Yep, yeah, you guys get... Oh, what happened to Argos? Did he get bribed? What happened, bro? So, my god! Fuck this... Fucking bribing and assassination shit. It's so annoying. How annoying can you get? That means we've lost that unit. That's a thousand down the drain, bro. Hey, we made a... Made a cavalry stable there. So maybe we need to go for the cavalry stables before we can actually get anything. Go for a little barracks. Now, let's not go for a barracks. Let's go for one of these. See what shrines lead places. Why can we not get these? Shrine to Apollo. Shrine to Demeter or above. Mm. So this, this settlement can't get any decent shrines, unfortunately. They are close to upgrading, though, so that's not a problem. Argos, are we building? Nope, because of that damn fucking bribing. Oh, well. Any more mercenaries available? No. 
Okay, let's end the turn. We're going to be slapping through turns uh, in this early stage. Where we're just trying to build up and build up our economy and stuff. Thing that worries me. Rhodes have had a while to siege us down. Hmm. Yeah, they've had a while to siege us down. So, we're going to be losing troops. And on top of that. Yes, my lord. Emporion. On top of losing troops, we're going to have... Let's have a look how many we've lost. I'm starting to lose a, a few. Uh, yeah, we're going to be losing troops. And on top of that, they might be building up their troops in Rhodes. Which is a minor city, so we should definitely go for that. I think while we're at it as well, we should recruit some more of these and send them across. Recruit a ship here in Argos. Oh my god, are you, are you fucking kidding me? Bribed again! You fucking pieces of shit, Athens. What dickheads, man. I'm just tempted to put our, our general in there. I mean, they shouldn't bribe the general, should they? I've just spent so much money. I'm trying to build stuff here, bro. What fucking pricks, man. I was going to recruit a ship here as well. Let's do that. If I lose this fucking ship now, and I lose my general, I'll be fucking fuming, bro. He's only got three influence. How is he bribing this settlement? Fucking prick. Alright, let's end it. I told you I was going to get salty. I told you. If stupid shit like that happens, I will get salty. <laughs> Uh, and trust me, that is stupid shit, man. I worked hard for those settlements. I'm not willing to just give them up to your stupid, foolish ways. At least you didn't bribe it this time. Oh my days. Athens have come over here. Why? <laughs> Why would you do this? I think we lose those armies. Yes, sir. <laughs> Need to get there. You need to get there. Get back. Do we just abandon this settlement? I think we might. Uh, so if we rally out. So a lot to deal with. Archers again. It's just that cavalry that's going to be really, really strong. Like, we don't have that much. And he's got so much cavalry. I think he'll, find, he'll th think he's strong enough to take the settlement, though, this time. Let's have a look. Make sure that Athens are not allied with them. Uh, Athens, Athens, Athens. No, no, they're not allied with the with them, so that's good for us. I think we still wait them out then. That's all we can do right now. More mercenaries, we'll take them. We have to. Got no one in in Sparta at the minute because we had to put our freaking people there. Oh god, I do get salty. <laughs> How's this going to make things? Ah, you're going to reduce taxes a lot. Over time, though, that should become a lot better. And it gives a population bonus, which is great. Yeah, Megalopolis. Do we have corruption here? Because we could do with the law if we do. No, we're too close to our, our, our capital, aren't we? So I don't think we need any of those yet. You guys come down here. There's a lot of mines around here. I see. Who are you? I can't use you to uh, make things. That's fine. Ah, uh, well, I'm hoping they attack it. Three more turns and then we have to attack them. Well, two more, really. If they don't attack this time, they are pussios, man. 
Oh, Athens attacked Rhodes. That's great for us. We go. Attack that Rhodian army, you fools. I'm hoping they do. This might be our saviour. Athens might save us here. <laughs> go on, Athens. Go on, you boys. You've got to do it next turn. Otherwise, we have to deal with both of these freaking armies, man. You get on. Problem is now... Uh, this is going to be hard. If Rhodes attacks... We will have lo we will lose because we can't get to them and there's no chance we beat that army with this army. Like zero. So I hope Athens is, is first up in the uh, running order. Over here. We go for a level one. Uh, should we go for level one? No, I think we go for land clearance. What else can we build? Nothing really. Need to keep training at Sparta. I think we train that first. And then we'll train uh, some more spearmen. We can train over here as well. Skiritai. Oh, we haven't seen these guys yet. 17 morale. Pretty good. 13. They're light infantry, but they look pretty decent. Let's get a, let's get one of those. Is there anyone we, else we can train? Sparta. No, Sparta, let's not do that. Let's keep on training proper troops. Go with these guys. I like these guys. They're, they're pretty... They're a lot cheaper than their Hoplotite. And they're not that much worse. They actually have better morale. They've not got good armor, but... That's not too much of a worry. We can actually get them here as well, so we should have been doing that. Let's go with that. Another turn! Slap that turn button! <laughs> Why has Athens gone for us as well? Like, that's annoying. They're at war with the Antigonids and they put their biggest army onto Kyrene? <laughs> like, sounds like a good idea. Sounds like the AI is just targeting the player. Oh, fuck me. Who's across here? Carthage, let's go talk to you. Athens and Rhodes, Parni and the Seleucids. So what's going on? <gasps> Athens! You beauty! <laughs> and they lost a load of men in that battle. You fucking lunatics. Sarka and Parni, Kingdom of Media and Bosporans. Parni and Bactria, deaded. Sparta, do we have access to cavalry now? We do. We need we need some cavalry. Let's go for a building. We get some missile troops. I don't think we go for that. Minus 20 to yeah, I don't think. Go for the crop rotation and then Igeon if we go for the market, how much is that going to benefit us? Still reduces taxes more. That reduces taxes by even more. Everything does. Let's just go for more trade. Because the trade eventually will be worth more than our taxes. Let's get you guys into Sparta. Let's get you guys as well. I think... Send you across. Ah, uh, we can't yet. We'll send you across next turn. I'm hoping Athens tries to take this settlement because we'll win. We definitely will, will win now. Make sure we're building everywhere. Megapolis, of course. Don't really want any of those, bro. So let's end the turn again. I'm just hoping we can get another battle in before the end of the uh, thing. But it's been a lot of uh, campaign management, hasn't it? Well, there's been a few battles, to be fair. Some big ones. Some nice ones. Uh, Rhodes has come again, eh? And Athens hasn't attacked us this time. Interesting. I think if we can get those other troops from Sparta across, I think we can take that Athenian army at least. My lord. Take them both. Can't even get them in. 
Let's get you here. And let's go for it. We should win this. I hope we do. They're quite reduced. We'll do this as the final battle and then we'll end the episode. So let's go for it. Let us go for it. I can't wait. This is brutal. This is going to be a big battle. Oh, yes. And we've got cavalry now. Yay! Cavalry. Our first unit of cavalry. Damn Athenians, man. But roads are being more annoying, so we should go after roads after this straight away. It looks like they've lost a lot of troops on the island, which... I mean, it's a good thing for us. It's a good thing for us. A very good thing for us, in fact. Damn Athenians. Damn Rhodians. Everyone is damned, okay? Everyone. Damn everyone. Damn them all. Let's listen. Yes, come on. I didn't click on night battle. Why is it always a night battle? <sighs> oh my god. Those troops are so damaged. So, they should be coming in from the right. So, honestly, I think they will think they're stronger than us. So, let's get these guys here. These guys here. The only good troops we have are our generals right now. So, get them in front. Right, let's... Uh, Organize these so archers, peltasts together. Then you boys, yeah, keep you guys go in front and we use the generals either side. I'm hoping the lack of uh, morale doesn't apply because he's not the leading general. Peltas there. We'll make sure all of you guys are off that. There we are. Very long range missiles. Ah, here they are. They're coming straight away. Uh, well, what we should do, actually, is just get rid of some of these units that have nobody in. Because I think we've got four units in that army, right? Let's have a look. So two have come in. And there is two more to come in. So get rid of those guys. Let them get out. And you guys can come and join. And hopefully we can get these last two as well, including the cavalry. They're not moving. <sighs> Got rid of those two. So we should, they should come in now. Come on. You should come in now, bros. Ah, oh, come on. Right, let's go. We'll shoot them with our Cretan archers. General, we'll get the generals out of the back. They can ch like deal with any charging cavalry or anything like that. So why haven't you come in? I got rid of two units so you guys could come in, bro. I need you, cavalry. I'm not sure these guys will be able to move as well. That's the other thing. Oh, let's have a look at these uh, new units as well. These guys, these swordsmen. Well, oh, they look pretty cool. Oh, wait, do they have phalanx spears or what? So if you put you on that. Looks like you have phalanx spears. But then you have swords. I'm confused. Are you phalanxes or what? Put you on guard mode now. I know, what does it say? It says you've just got 13 melee attack and you look like you've got a shield. A sword and shield on your thing, so. Let's go. Get you forward. Yes, the cavalry's coming now. Spartan cab, ready to go. You guys down here. Yes, archers, you should be ready to fire now. What are they doing? Yes, fire. 
What is this? One of these skirmishers. Shoot those hoplites. And then what are these? More Greek archers. Mm. Oh, the Javi should shred them. Oh, Javi's just going in at left, right, and centre. I don't know where they're going. Let's have a look at our cav as well. We've not seen these guys before. God, they do look very like cav. They look like they're basically just wearing robes. Oof. Oh, well. Well, all the uh, actual units with, with someone in them. Just bring you forward. What's this? Get you guys forward as well. Pop when you go around. And then we'll get the Cretans forward if we can. Where's our generals? Maybe I've forgotten to bring them. I can't remember. Oh, they're just there. That's fine. What are you? Athenian Hoplites? I think we'll do well against them. Guard mode. We'll stick you all on guard mode. See what happens. See whether you go in phalanx formation for guard mode. Now you're going in a lot better formation though for fighting, I would say. These guys. Like, why are they, what are those spears? I don't get it. Well, here come the cavalry. Oh, that cavalry got shredded. You guys get in. You guys get into those guys. You guys get into the Thropperoi before they can uh, charge us at themselves. Well, where did you come from? Let's go around this way, boys. You're needed. You're needed on the flank as well. Same as you. Oh, look at them. They can just push through. I don't get that. It is a general bodyguard unit, so maybe it's that's why. But you get in there. You guys get round. This is a big brawl. How are we all doing? They're all eager, which is great for us. You guys get round. You guys try and flank them. I could do with a big charge on the back of there. Where are you going? You crazy bastard. Come on, cavalry, let's go. This should be huge. I say huge. Means limp wristed. Really wristed. Oh, they lost like so many troops in that. Now through. Ah, oh, the Greek. The general came. They lost like half the men in that, man. I really can't tell who's who over here. That's, that's the annoying thing right now. Let's get in the back of there. You guys get over here. I think my cavalry can deal with this. It's just one guy. Even pressing the space bar, I can't tell who's who. We're shredding them though. How many have we lost? 20%. Get into the slingers. You should shred the slingers, surely. The Theroparoi are there in the middle. You guys get through. They're all shredded. They're all they're all running away. Let's get out you out. See whether we can stop them fight fighting to the death. You guys get over there. Apart from you, General, you're getting the Theroparoi. Oh, we've shredded them. Well done, Athens. This is what you get, my friend. I hate these night battles as well. I just, I didn't choose night battle. Why has it put me randomly on night battle? Makes no sense. The enemy showed a true virtue. They are not Let's get these guys. We need to get these guys to make sure we get under 15%. 
think they had two generals though. Or did they just have one? Maybe it was just one. But we killed one general anyway. I believe. Yeah, one general. Zuthus. Should be lower than 15% now. Nice. 590. We killed double them, which is good. Decent. A lot of kills. 103 for the Peltas. So the Javis are really strong in this. 69 for the Kretar archers. Nice. Well done, boys. Well done. Well, our next target is the Rhodian army there, but I think we'll do that next episode. But let's have a look at where this leaves us anyway and what we're going to do on, to the, on the next episode, which I cannot wait for. Um, it's going to be fun. It's tough. It feels like it's not... It doesn't feel like two episodes, does it? It feels like a lot more than that. Um, so let's go... You three in there. You can stay. And we built the port. So let's go for the military government. governor. We're building everywhere else. No. Let's go for the communal farming here. Aegean. Yeah, we're building everywhere else. Nice. And then at Sparta, we don't have anyone in Sparta, do we? So let's recruit one of you just to stay in Sparta. Ah, well, Athens, you fools. We should be decent enough to take Athens now. But I don't want to risk it because of the crashing. That's the problem. But next uh, episode, guys, we will go straight for this army and try and kill them. That should be good. Um, and then we'll move on to Rhodes, try and take Rhodes, and then maybe Athens. We'll see. Oh, look at this. The Boeotian League. Very big army there. Look at that. Well then, guys, thank you very much for watching. It's been a pleasure as always. Please subscribe, please like, all that good stuff. And I'll see you again on the next video.